Society's 80 odd members had a normal death. Wasn't there someone who lived for a dozen days or so? What was their name? Um, <laughs> That's pretty normal. Aren't the immortal bosses in games always waiting for the protagonist to come kill them? <laughs> Immortality is not always a good thing. <laughs> oh, what an alliance joke. Yes, I'm 
sensation. Remember it. that this fancy technique of yours is usual. <sighs> Just a little trick of tampering with the data of reality. I wouldn't call it fancy. What were you looking at so intently just now? Let me see. Herta's Toys, a catalog featuring the space station's collection of rare items. They've got a lot of interesting gadgets. Like what? There's this gun. It can rate any creature within its crosshair as a score from 0 to 100. Doesn't sound very interesting. Aren't you curious about how much you would score? I kind of want to know mine. Fine. I guess we can swing by and play with it if it's not too far. What's our destination? Go down the corridor behind the door on the left. There's a room where some kind of rare item is stored. And so that's where the Stellaron is. That's where we can find out where the Stellaron is.
be lots of Legion Void Rangers there. Okay. sensation. Remember it. work. Did Herda organize it herself? According to the access history, she hasn't logged in here for over six months. The evacuation was directed by the acting lead researcher, a girl named Asta. It doesn't ring a bell. Oh, right. Elio said we wouldn't run into Herta. It seems she really isn't here. Where's the Stellaron? Elio's script doesn't include any info about the location of the Stellaron, which means in the future he foresees... We would find the Stellaron in a non-physical way. This space station is packed with extraordinary objects. I wouldn't be surprised if there's one that can make it happen. Hiding something extraordinary with something extraordinary. This is pretty Herta. I assume you know what to do. I mean, you've read the catalog for quite a while. I've got all the clues we need. The only piece missing is a simple trick. Help me investigate the terminal in this room. Our item might be inside. Okay, the stage is yours. I can 
see the whole space station on the surveillance screen, but not the Stellaron. Even if you could, it'd be a trap. Herta doesn't display her collections. see the memory storage for this terminal. This is the monitoring room. They must have deleted the records and made a run for it. Classic. <sighs> Make your way over here then. There's no point in trying to search like this. plan? I'm all ears. It's a matter of hacking the surveillance system directly. Aha, uh -huh, I see. Hertz's collections aren't in the system, so anything unaffected should be our target. Simple, crude, but effective. Look, found it. What's this? Item number 211, Blind Spot. A simple light deflecting field. It allows an object in its field to pass unnoticed, but if a different item ceases to be obvious, the object gets revealed. So, Herta hides her collection with something as simple as this? The simplest method is the hardest to spot. Isn't that our motto? Strange thing number two. The data suggests it's just an ordinary hologram. But it has an added layer. Let's take a look. Don't worry, this place won't be our grave. Interesting. She's a member of the Genius Society, all right. The Stellaron is up ahead. Let's hurry. its own security system. I guess even for Herta, Stellaron is no ordinary rarity. Can you get it? Of course. Even the genius Herta can't compete with me when it comes to hacking. Good. Then I'll also count on you with the preparation of the receptacle. The receptacle's ready. Your decision. <laughs> <laughs> Elio said this decision will bring about lots of changes. He also said it must be you who makes it. been the ones taking Stellarons. It's the first time we're giving one out. Wanna give her a new name?
Hey, so you remember me? <sighs> well, listen. You are in a daze right now. You don't know who you are, why you're here, or what you're going to do next. You think I look familiar, but you're not sure if you should trust me. None of that matters. All you need to know is that I'm leaving, and you will be left all alone on this space station. From now on, you needn't think about your past or doubt yourself. Listen, in the near future, you will encounter all kinds of perils and hardships, but... You will also have many wonderful experiences. You'll meet companions who will treat you like family and embark on surreal adventures with them. At the end of your journey, all that perplexes you and troubles you will resolve. This is your future that Elio has foreseen. Do you like it? The next stop to pave the way for the future that is written. It's like weaving brocade. You and I can only add one gold thread each time, but eventually we will make a gorgeous pattern. How long do you think you need? According to the script, the Astral Express crew is arriving soon. We should avoid being seen by them. I know, Silver Wolf. Just give me another minute. I must leave now. Don't worry, someone will come and find you very soon. Just go with them. You won't remember a thing except me. When you have a chance to make a choice, make one that you know you won't regret. among them isn't around. Just some nasty minions. We'll take those invaders out soon. Don't worry. Uh-huh. A petite cutie with pink hair? Madam Herta appointed her to be the acting lead researcher. That girl really needs to step up. I can't believe her own employee doesn't even know her name. to the master control zone. Asta and the other researchers have gathered there. Plus, that's where we parked the Astral Express. Don't you worry. We'll protect you from the monsters and clear up this mess. Don Hong and I are members of the Astral Express crew. 
Well, the Express has some dealings with Madame Herta. So we come to visit the space station from time to time. We just so happened to arrive during this invasion. Of course, as a <coughs> crew of heroes, we're happy to lend a hand. Yeah, you've never seen it? The Express comes here every once in a while. It's a unique train that can travel between the stars with the power of the trailblaze, Eon. I'll show you once we're back to the master control zone. You and March go back together. Arlan from the security department lost contact in the vicinity. I need to find him first. Oh, all right. You stay safe. are rampaging through the space station like a pack of wolves. This trip won't be a walk in the park. It's better if you have something to protect yourself. Just a suggestion, though. You're safe as long as you stick with me. Thank you. 